Happy summer, everyone. It's been a few weeks since I filmed a greeting, and I hope everyone has found a way to disconnect a little. The best part about July 1st is being able to say, see you next month. You know, this time last year, we were in the middle of moving from four schools to five schools, opening a brand new high school, and generally having a crazy summer. And I thought, well, you know, at least next summer will be normal and we can catch our breath. Boy, was I wrong. Planning for our restart has been occupying every waking moment. I could give you updates on textbook adoption or course additions, but I know what you really want to hear about is what our plans look like for back to school. As I said in my last email, we're expecting to welcome our students back for in-person instruction on August 5th. Our survey had a fantastic response rate and really provided the insight we needed to make the decisions that lie ahead. We had over 90% of our participating families respond that they are ready to return to school with sanitation and health precautions in place. With that said, I fully acknowledge that guidance from the Department of Public Health may change that, and I am in constant communication with local officials to review any changes. With in-person instruction set to begin, our school administrators have been working diligently to address every facet of the school day. We expect to have those details available to you by July 10th. You know, I wish there was a perfect solution to what school will look like next year, but there just isn't. And anyone who tells you there is has never led a school before. I will tell you my team is working tirelessly to troubleshoot as many issues as possible to address the safety, physical, social, and emotional needs of our students and staff. I know that each of you have different concerns, and we hope that our comprehensive plan will help answer many of your questions. I can't tell you how much I appreciate your patience and your flexibility as we rewrite what back to school looks like. From virtual meetings to one-way halls, this is it's new for all of us. But what comes out of this experience for me is the sense of truly being able to partner with each of you in your child's education. I had a chance to read all the feedback sent in on the surveys and, and feel much more prepared to make the necessary decisions. Thank you for your continued support and have a happy and safe Independence Day.